Welcome back to Facts of Ellie. Nino the Beef is done. It's my thing show. In fact, I need you guys not to be too proud for the pride to like and subscribe. You did. <laughs> I'm gonna do this really again over. Subscribe to me to articulate. Articulate these words a little more better, so I'm just gonna do. I ain't got that much money right now. Give me time. I got you. I'm tired of feeling you too insensitive to get out your feelings. And what I'm feeling on your booty because it's so appealing. We all be scored the open wounds from love or port from the thugs that just wanna hit it. You feel me? But it's a gangster. My only intention is to wanna hear you. Maybe just because it's just wanna see you. Even though it ain't a scrub like it but I still need love. Even though it was hitting like me when not, it get a chip to skip it. I never bow my knees to no man on no system. Dealing with dealing with before I be submissive, they gon' have to kill me. Love is tricky by less of lowest frequency of love giving. I love giving. To the cube because I love you. And you do want my gangsters where I swear it's the thug in me that make me want to love plenty. If not, it's love plenty, love many. I put my trust to you because I couldn't trust women with lust in it. Unlike you, she different, like liquid buzz in it. That's why I buzz hit and you grab a cup, lift it. That's when the buzz hit and I grab a cup, lift All right, let me go and do this again. I'm going to start all over. I'm tired of feeling you too insistent get out your feelings. Why I'm feeling on your booty because it's so appealing. When you often score the open wounds from love but apart from the thugs and just want to hit it. You feel me? But it's against my own intentions to want to heal you. Maybe because I just want to sing you. Even though one ain't a scrub like LL but still need love even though it's hitting. Like Luminati with a gender skipping. I never bow my knees to no man or no assistant. Dealing with dealing with who I be submissive they gon' have to kill me. Love is trigger by less of lowest frequency of love giving. I love giving to the cube because I love tricky. We do I'm a gangster. I swear it's the thug in me that made me want to love plenty, not love any. Love many. So I put my trust in you because I couldn't trust women with less than one like you. She different like liquor with a buzz in it. That's when the buzz hit me. I grab a cup, lift it. Why not? If it's empty, then fill it up, sip it. Pass a cup with it. Rebel Street with a rebel beat. I done got my thugs tipping. Like I said, I love women, but it's hard to trust in one corrupt with less than and that's how I basically want to spit anything I write. You know what I'm saying? If I'm going to read off my pad, same thing for go for any lyricists. You're going to really have to really read. Most of the time, I'm going to remember it. But if I don't have time, I, write, I go in the booth and remember it. Like, just spit it off my pad. Or, like you say, the phone. Whatever you want to call the phone. Because, you know, I don't write in my pad no more. If you see my rhyme book, my rhyme book. I'm going to let you guys see my rhyme book. My, my rhyme book is legendary. Rhyme book is like literally this freaking high. And my homeboy say that all the time. He say, he said, I never thought I could meet a rapper. I think Tupac would take a, a interest in that would really look at like, dang, you got something that I can't. Or, like my rhyme book was high. He was like, Tupac would probably be jealous of that. Like, damn, how you get that many rhymes? Like, Pac wouldn't be chill. Pac wouldn't, I know what he meant, probably zealous. He He's a very, he, I'm zealous. Like, I like to compete with energy. That's zealous. People don't know what that means. It's not jealousy. It's a, me and my homeboy, seriously, very, very, very zealous. We, we see each other on the stage. We know, okay, I'm really finna have to come on with it. This nigga gonna shoot the house when I'm, when I'm doing poetry. You know what I'm saying? The poetry bar. That's zealous. We don't, we don't, we don't never envy each other. He has money. I do my thing. You know what I'm saying? He has, he's a retired soldier. He's forever paid. Um, and we just we just use each other energy to boost our you know competitive soul for music, poetry, arts, and that's zealous. We don't we don't we don't never be jealous of one another. Never never. Um, but we are zealous, ambitious workers. And then Tupac will probably be would be zealous because he's a very competitive person, and that's normal for a person that yeah. is competitive. And I just want to say that Tupac can have a jealous bone in his body about anybody. And um, that's why when people try to make it seem like, oh, Tupac, did, Tupac really was on a whole nother level. I never seen him really hate on anyone, any person, period. But that's just wanted to give you guys something. That's the final one. I know you guys are like that. Um, I articulate the, articulate the words a little more. And I do believe in taking you guys' advice. Um, to a subscriber said, rapping without my grill. I love rapping without my grill. I rap without my, but I don't. I don't. I love rapping with my grill. So it's like both. It's like can't beat them, join them. Um, he think he said, would I be a better rapper? I mean, will words flow better? Of course. Um, I'm learning how to rap with my grill. Like I had my grill for a long time. 
And I used to look at a lot of my videos. I'm like, I am slurring. Oh my God, when I rap. So I see why. But long story short, a lot of times in them old, old videos, like five years ago, I was rapping the same word pattern. So sometimes I notice when I speed it up. Yeah, I can take bits and bits and I'll be like, you know, I got to learn how to properly place my tongue in a certain place of my teeth like you're supposed to do. Sometimes my tongue, it, it, it ellipses. It lifts. I don't talk on the lips, but it ellipses because of the grill. And um, I had to remind myself, I have to learn how to talk properly with my grill. Like, you know what I'm saying? And that's just it. Long story short. But I really appreciate you guys' advice. It's really dope. Really dope. Like a mother sucker. And I appreciate it. It really helps. All the people who are giving real advice. Like, do this. Do this. Do this. I take all advice if it's good. If it's, if it's coming from a positive place of energy. And to the dude. Let me get on his ass. This dude is subscribed to my channel. I got your, I got your punk ass name wrote down right here somewhere. Rose Dector. Man, you always saying some negative shit, bro. You know what I'm saying? Talking about is it, that's funny though. He said it's some it's some freestylers on, on SoundCloud that are that are freestyle stump you out. Dude, you gotta be out of your everlasting mind. First of all, no one's freestyling on SoundCloud, you dumbass, because it's a streaming network. First of all, you you gonna tell me this. This is how I know you you you're uneducated, you dumb little motherfucker. If you was trying to get a million strings right. Would you be freestyling? You know what I'm saying? Who gonna freestyle a fucking song, you fucking idiot? Now, I have freestyled parts of a song, certain songs, this and that. I do not, I do not suggest anyone freestyling a song. Unless you Lil Wayne does, and let's be real, Lil Wayne is not freestyling the whole songs. He is punching in. He's punching in. Anybody, Tory Lane's one of the best ones to do that. And he, to me, he punches in. I don't, I have women in the studio. I could play a song and freestyle all my verses, all my verses to a song because I was not supposed to be featuring this person's song and they, they didn't have a complete song. They, I've been told them they supposed to be prepped. I let you guys hear it, matter of fact. So we give you guys an extra little special little gift, right? How, why not? How about that? If I have that song on here, I think I do. And this is an artist I used to work with. She got, I'm gonna let you guys hear a song. I don't know if I have it. I think I have it in this. Let's see. <sighs> She's a hell of a rapper, but her mind was whew, out of there. Trying to keep her to, to rap. Mm -mm. I have it somewhere. I'm seeing. Mm. There you go. And we did somehow Tupac to do for love. And really, this was supposed to be a song I was supposed to do, but I already had some shit for it. But I had no idea. I just wanted her to do this track because the track she had did not go with what she rapped. And she did not rap it right to the track. Long story short, so I like, hey, put on another track. This, uh, maybe that'll, that'll boost her, you know, confidence. And it did. i like, nah, you feel the beat? She like, I feel that beat. I'm like, do it to this beat. You know what I'm saying? Put it on this beat. And it's a classic. It's like you sample in it. So it's like the same song. And that's how we got this song, um, Tupac, Do For Love. And she's a great artist. I used to fuck with her. Girl, I, used to, must think I'm a love, I used to date her. We used to fuck around. And I'll tell you the story of that a long time ago. I, I mean, a, another time. I got it. I messed this up. I'm going to put on other verse because I fucked that one up. I want to try to redo it. <laughs> I'm going to put on other version. See it. See it. Mm. Just took out here. I don't like that. You gotta, I got to re redo that. I'm trying to think I'm an engineer and shit. But I want you guys to hear this shit real quick. Mm. Audio. I only got one song, two songs on here. Then what's all the songs? They must be on this phone. They on this phone. Then I'm, I gotta have the other song. Hey, yo, what's good, love? Hey, yo, oh, what's Lord. good? Okay, well, let me see if it's down here. Yeah. Let me see. There you go. I love you, girl, but you must think I'm a sucker for love, my nigga. Love, my nigga. Nah. Is that it? I think that's it. I don't give a damn what nobody thinks. 
Oh yeah, that's it. That's it. That's it. I'm gonna delete the other one. That's my old self. I don't sound like that now. I see, you know, I feel the breeze with ease to the host. I taste my cheese. My mom's good in life. This shit is you and me. One is fire. So what you want to do? Just for Let him rock my roller, roller coaster. coaster. <laughs> I think she did send me. I had a rope up like papers in the folder. I got him tied up, wrapped around my pinky. Every time he's stepping on my nipples like a pinky. I said, come here, baby. I'm talking about me. What you talking about? Because I'm living like a pinky. In the brain. What is you doing? Quit hating on my poor. Are you going to let her play no board? She did about this me. Uh uh. Uh uh-uh, uh, we gotta play this bag. She about diss me. Where's that song at? Where's she at? There we go. I don't wanna hear the whole thing again. What happened? Oh, I love man. you, girl. I don't want to hear this me all over again. Love my love my nah. you you? Did you hear what she said? She like, I got a sucker on my thing like it's a binky. Anybody know I don't eat pussy, but I suck the hell out of your titties. I let them play. 